I honestly can't tell you how much Black Stamina has been continuously interesting and overall I thought the pace change from him, you know, taking on the heroes and practically training them to uh, the overall craziness that is what he's done and made it look so simple right to take out something of a s class that even this legendary crew of people aren't taking out they're going to retreat from at this point in time just speaks another volume on uh the scariness if they don't figure out um their leveling if they don't figure out a way to be in a better position to take care of the world there's only so many people that can and of course after the training and pretty much just putting them through hell uh fighting a squid without their armor so they could take more damage and have to be more cautious even in a battle like that which i'm guessing it's another monster the freaking demon princess fished up <laughs> which is kind of crazy to think how much strength you would need just to fish up these types of things um but yeah that that just goes to show you yet again even fishing in a dungeon <coughs> can ultimately lead you to the main boss like these are the types of stuff that make me want to uh not only learn more but just be imported into uh, more shows that do stuff like this, that have this type of finesse with their world and interest, because at this point, they made it so casual, but what do we know about this show? As soon as these types of things happen, that's ar that's armor material, that's potentially growth, uh, even further than just oh yeah you you beat these you beat this monster and you got XP like nah there could be multiple things that came from that one exchange and they just glossed over it like it, it was nothing so it kind of goes to show you how even S rank monsters are not really the goal of our main character to get those types of things but seeing his main goal being rice and him enjoying the hell out of it just makes it that much funnier to see him uh truly get something he wants and not be able to hold back um the elf girl has the new scariest like potential to be the true leader of the group i think that's a that's kind of sketch right like all of a sudden he looks over at her and she has such a scary face to him that we can't even see it. It can't be shown in public, okay? There's uncensored stuff that's being shown, uh, episodes, and there's no uncensored for this. You just can't see the elf, what she's doing. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, it is by far an enjoyable show to keep watching. Black Summonat is getting closer to the end of its season. But with all of y'all talking to me in the comments, I appreciate seeing that uh, whenever you correct me. So I do hope there's more parts to come or if anything, there's more of the adaptation still being continued. So there's a future for this show because as of right now, uh, there's a couple big plots that can still happen. We got the Demon King making monsters stronger in dungeons and we have the Demon King's uh, daughter, not to mention... Uh, you know, there's the revenge for our Dark Knight that's rocking with us. So a lot of things I can still go on and probably come up with. So it's getting really, really fun to watch. And I hope y'all are enjoying it as much as me. And if you are, thank you so much for even clicking. And I hope to hear from you in the comments. Drop a like, subscribe if you did make it this far. Because it helps the channel tremendously. And I'll definitely talk to y'all in the next one. Peace.